Hi everyone and welcome back. So today I thought I would talk about my favourite or well current go-to facial oils at the minute. I had so many people message me asking me to do like a tutorial or like a review on certain serums or like what I like most. So today I just thought I'd do like my top three what I'm loving at the minute. Now if I am being completely honest my routine does change slightly almost all the time it's just whatever mood I'm feeling in whatever serum or oil I tend to reach for but the three I'm going to show you today are the ones that I've literally been obsessed with over the last few weeks or so so I'll show you them today and a lot of people did also ask me to do my skincare routine which I am hoping to do it's just at the minute because I'm just constantly trial and testing out new products my routine isn't always the same so I mean, it's the same in terms of like I'll do like cleanse, tone, hydrate, serums, SPFs, things like that. But in terms of products, they can vary slightly. But I will do like a basic routine of what I do and how I take cleanse my skin and things like that. So I'll do that in the next couple of weeks. But today, as I say, it's just all about facial oils and I do love a good facial oil. So I've got three with me. I've got more of an affordable one, more of like a middle and then a more of expensive one. So we'll go through them all with you as well. So I'll start off with my absolute favourite and probably the one that I do get the most compliments for when I do wear it. And it unfortunately it is the most expensive one. But I'll show you it anyway. And it is Elemis Pro Collagen, sorry, Pro Definition Facial Oil. So it is part of their Pro Collagen and like um range as well. So I also got this at Christmas with the Pro Collagen Cleansing Balm, which I'm sure you all know I am obsessed with. So the whole range, like the Pro range, I absolutely love. And this, as I say, I got at Christmas. So I've used that much, but as I say, I don't always use it because, as I say, I'm just constantly trying different serums and oils and things like that. But this is probably one of my favourites at the minute. And it really is such a lovely product. And... I do get so many compliments when I wear it. When I put it on, a lot of people tend to say to me, what have you got on your skin? Your skin's looking amazing. I've also had someone say my skin look, looks like glass, which I was so happy with. So, so I do definitely think it is such a gorgeous oil. Now, a lot of people do think, seem to think as well, if you are oily, you can't necessarily wear a facial oil. When that's not the case, you can wear an oil, obviously just take into consideration the type of oil. So if you are oily, a lot of people, what I've found anyway, when you are oily, normally underneath it can be surface dry as well. So an oil will help like combat that and even it out, but obviously just take into consideration and bear in mind throughout the day. But as I say, it's one of my favourite oils. I'll show you quickly. Now, it does retail, I think, for £65. So as I say, it is, it is one of the more expensive products. But as you can see, it just literally runs off straight. And then I, I like to just pat it into the skin. And I'll show you. One thing you never want to do with a facial oil or a serum, you never want to rub it in. You would always just want to press it and pat it into the skin so your skin's just absorbing it instantly. So what I will do, I will cleanse, tone as normal. Then I'll put a hyaluronic acid on just so I've got like some hydration as well. And then I'll press, then press this into the skin. So... You can see it just how much of a gorgeous glow it gives. Like, really does give the skin that, like, luminosity, like, radiance finish that we all want, especially during summer as well. And it's just, you can see, it's just so lovely. So that's definitely one of my favourite facial oils and probably the one I do use the most, but because it is obviously a little more expensive, I do try to only use small amounts. But the great thing is, as well, you will have seen, I literally only used a drop. So, like that much I use I hardly use any of it because it is more of a thick and oil, a thicker oil it does go further as well so it just sits on the skin and it literally absorbs and honestly I get so many compliments when I wear this it's easily a favorite probably the favorite serum of mine anyway but that's pro definition facial oil from Elemis I love it and then coming on to Emma Hardy's this is their brilliant facial oil this retails for, well it did, it did retail for, because I think I got it for £31, but for some reason, I've mentioned this before, I don't know the reason as to why, but M. Hardy have increased the range, sorry, increased the price of the range 
so I'm not unsure as to, as to entirely why they have done that but I know they have so this now is £39 which again I still do think is a reasonable amount for a facial oil as well and it's it's similar consistency to Elemis as well it is a little bit more thicker obviously compared to a serum which is obviously more thinner so it looks like this again very similar you've got the pipette style applicator it was like that I'll put it on this side and you can just basically see just literally a little drop and then press and pat into the skin oh, it smells so nice I think that's why I love products so much like the smell I just love smells that are so clean and fresh smelling as well so that's that one you can see straight away that obviously the Elemis one is more luminous but it's still obviously a lovely oil as well and it just sits perfectly on the skin but they're the two in comparison well, I say this is my favourite but obviously I will still use Elemis and with that though you do get 30ml of product with Elemis you do only get 15ml so you're practically getting double the amount of this but obviously this is a lot more expensive so obviously just bear that in mind but as I say they both are really nice serums sorry oils and then last this I love so this is from the skin prep and she's actually a really really good friend of mine we've known each other for so long we went right through school together and she's now decided her name's laura she's now decided to produce because when we were growing up we both loved we were both obsessed with skincare we would find us in like the skincare aisle in like aston and morrison's when we were like 16 and we'd literally be there for hours just looking at all like the different products the body creams and we were like hold oh, like comparing but just always been an obsession and since i think it was like last year or so laura has now created and developed her own line which i am so proud of it and i just love her products and i just think for someone who's so young as well she's so passionate about what she does and she really has created an amazing products considering it's like her first run and first go of everything so this is glow oil what she's created so it does contain vitamin e and rose hip and you can see it is a more of a yellowy orangey color but it smells insane so it looks like this again the pipette style you get 30 ml of product it smell i can't describe the smell it's like such a lovely smell it's it's similar similar to terry's chocolate orange but not as intense like it's just got a slight that orangey zesty smell it's so nice and when you put it on i tend to wear this during the evening with the two with those two i will normally wear it every day but because i then do have facial oils for every evening mainly like estee lauder's advanced night repair range i'll tend to use like an oil from their range overnight but i have used this in the past overnight and i absolutely love it and it just when you're asleep you can still smell it it's just, it's lovely so i'll just quickly show you as well what it's like on the skin Again, you'd only need a small drop. And you just want to, again, just want to press it into the skin. And the great thing is as well, you can actually mix this in with your foundation. And this is what I have done today. And you can see it just does give a gorgeous luminosity finish to the skin, what we all want. It is summer and everyone wants to be glowing from the gods. And obviously you can use your highlighters and things like that. But when I was mixing it in, I, I, I used a luminous silk today. I'm on his luminous silk and i mix two drops no one one drop and a tiny little drop into the foundation just mixed it and then just buffed it in with a, a, a brush and it was so gorgeous but you can see that's the product there so obviously this one down here is the glow oil from the skin prep this one was elemis and this one's emma hardy so you can see they all are really gorgeous facial oils and they do give off that nice radiant finish and as i say this one is more affordable than you've got Emma Hardy, which is in the middle, and then you've then got Elemis, which is obviously a lot more expensive. But I think personally, if you are going to invest a product, invest in your cleansers and your oils and things like that, because they are what are going to nourish your skin, clean your skin, and really look after your skin. And I genuinely do believe in investing in your skin. And as much as you can get cheaper products, which I absolutely love, I do think as well it is good to sometimes just invest in like maybe a good serum or like a good oil, just because they do have like the anti-aging aspects as well and things like that. A lot of does go into it. But these are my three favourite oils at the minute, and I just love it. I love when I've cleansed all my skin put everything on and then just press this in and it just feels so lovely so 
Right, they're my favourites and I will link everything below in the, in the description box just basically telling you what the product is and where you can get it from. And as I say, I will do more videos later on as well of like my skincare. But if you did want to see any other videos, just leave comments in the description box below. And I'll see you all in my next video. Bye.